Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as most of you know, I have a second job at Target and we recently switched over Target Cartwheel to Target Circle. So if you are unfamiliar with it or you're, you have some questions on how to use it, because I do get a lot of people asking and actually I did have a guest at my store request that I do this video. So here we are and I will walk you through how to use Target Circle. So it looks like this, if you have the app on your phone, there might be kind of a glare, but this is what it looks like. So you'll wanna download that on your phone. Um, and if you don't have it, you'll just go to your app store, select or type in Target Circle, and then you'll see it, download it. You might have to sign up if you've never used it before, um, but then it'll give you this screen that looks like this. So if you can see that. So the gist of Target Circle is you're gonna have different buttons down here and those are important because this first one is gonna take you to the main Target app, which looks like this. And in there you can browse, you can shop by category, you can see the weekly ad, and then here's where the Target Circle offers are going to be. So next one is my store. You can set it to your store um, of your choice. You can change it to, you don't have to keep it set that way. And then wallet is gonna be the screen that I showed you first. And this is gonna be where all of your offers are gonna be saved right here. And then the next screen is your cart. And when you get to that screen, this is gonna be where you have any items saved if you wanna shop online. And then the next one is just going to be, I'm using someone else's, so I'm gonna cover the name, but it's just gonna be how much you've saved. And then um, all of your purchases that you've done either online or in store, you'll find right there. Okay. So that's the gist of all the tabs that you'll see on Target Circle. So then next, to see, you can do two, you can do one of two things. You can either browse Target Circle offers on the button on the home screen. So if you just hit the Discover button here, then you'll tap Target Circle and it'll take you to this page that looks like this. And this will be all the different categories that um, there will be offers in for Target Circle for the week, the month, a day. Um, it just kind of depends on what they do. So then you can just click one. So like this will be all. If you click it, then it'll take you through all the offers um, that are in Target Circle and you can just browse. Another thing you can do if you don't do that is you can, while you're shopping, you can hit the scan button right here. And if you hit that, it'll take you to the scanner and then you can scan the barcode on the product that you're, that you're um, looking for to see if there is an offer on there. If there is, it'll pop up with the percent and it'll automatically save it to your cart. If there's not, then it'll just say no results found and then you know that there's no offers on that product for the week. Um, you, so once you have all your offers saved, they're gonna be saved in here. And I don't know if you can see, but it'll say Target Circle offers there. And then this is the barcode that you want to give to the cashier to scan. And this barcode is what's going to take off all of your offers that you have saved. Um, always check your receipt because sometimes manufacturer coupons are on here and the manufacturer coupons don't always come off of the product. So if you notice that, then you'll just want to take your receipt up to guest service and then they'll adjust it for you. Um, they also have like a for you section on here where it'll just be exclusive offers for you and how this works is if you buy a lot of like one product for example i purchase a lot of like bedding sheets and comforter um, sets and stuff like that so then i always have special offers for like 15 percent off bedding um i know sometimes they put like toilet paper and that kind of stuff in here as well um so this is important. You can browse it while you're sitting at home. I browse it while I'm laying in bed. Um, if I'm bored, you can just literally browse, have everything saved so that when you do your trip at the store, you can make your list. This is what I do. I make my list based on what I already have in my Target Circle offers. So if I have 15% off of a particular meet, then I write that on my list and then I put cartwheel next to it in parentheses. So I know that when I'm at Target, I need to show my, my barcode 
to the cashier so that I can get the percentage off of my meat. So that's one way you can do it um, is to plan ahead. Otherwise, like I said, you can do it while you're in the store. Um, I don't really have a product here from Target that I can show you um, to scan, I don't think. I'm going to show you how, so I found just some antacid chewables that I have here. Um, you know that they're from Target because it says up and up. Um, so what we're going to do is, again, we're going to go to this barcode here. So we're going to click that. It's going to take you to your camera. And then what you're going to do is you're going to hold it up to the barcode. So we're just going to hold it up to the barcode. And it's going to give you the online price, oops, the online price, so $4.89, but if you notice, there's nothing on Cartwheel on there. If there was, it would be in red right here, and it would check it for you, so there's nothing on Cartwheel for these, but I do want to point out, um, say that you're shopping at the store, and you notice that these are $6.99 on the shelf, okay, but when you scan it, they're $4.89. It's important that so the Target stores are separate from Target.com. They're two separate entities. So you're going to notice that either the store has cheaper prices or maybe online has cheaper prices or maybe they're exactly the same. Um, if you see that they're cheaper online, go ahead and show this to the cashier and then they can adjust the price for you um, because they do price match target.com. So I get a lot of questions about that as to why it's cheaper online versus in store or vice versa. And that's why they're two separate entities. So different prices, different, um, coupons, different everything. It's just, it's sometimes it's all different, but we still do price match. Um, another thing that I wanted to go ahead and mention is if you have the red card, target circle is not going to save you any additional um, savings in terms of that 1%. So how it works is if you have the red card, you're still going to save that 5% every single time. If you don't have a target red card though, and you go and you use, say your bill is $150, you're going to save 1% of that purchase. And then what's going to happen is it's going to go onto a gift card. Um, and it's going to show you that on your main screen here. So if you can see where it says target circle earnings this one right here that will tell you so right now we have three dollars and seventy cents onto a gift card and that's just because um a red card is not being used during these transactions so then in order to use that what you're going to do is you're going to tap on add payment and then well actually hang on you're going to hit apply and i don't want to hit apply because this isn't my phone but if you hit apply here that's going to go into your barcode and then that will allow you to save that $3.70 um, on your purchase. Or if you want to buy something online, you can do that exact same thing and then it'll just apply the gift card to your online purchase as well. Um, but if you want to add your red card, so if you notice, the screen is currently white, okay? So that means that no red card is currently added to this wallet. So in order to do that, you're going to hit add payment. And then right here where it says red card, you're going to hit that check mark or that plus mark. And then once you hit that, you'll, your red card will be there too. It'll show you your red card here. Um, you hit that plus and then it'll have you verify your PIN number to your card. And then what's going to happen is, is this screen where it's all white right here is going to turn red. And then that's how you're going to know that your red card is saved. And that's nice because if you forget your red card one day, but you have your phone, you can literally just give this barcode to the cashier. And even if you don't have any Target Circle offers on here, this is still going to take the payment of your red card. But just make sure that this is red. If it's white, then you know that your card's not linked to it. Um, if you don't want that, though, then you can, to uncheck your card, you would just do the same thing. You would just go to add payment and then you can uncheck it there. Um, and then it'll go back to this white screen and then that way you can still save your um, circle offers but you won't have to worry about your red card if you want to use a different form of payment um, if you want to use a gift card anything like that you can add gift cards to your wallet too so same thing add payment and then any gift cards that you already have in your wallet you'll have to add them um, will show up there and then you just tap that plus sign and hit save then you'll see right here in this main screen it'll show all of the 
gift cards that you currently have available. Um, it's important to make sure that you have any gift cards you want to use saved in here on this front screen because once that cashier clicks that or scans that barcode, they can't go back and scan it again. Um, they'd have to avoid the entire transaction. And especially if you have a large transaction, I know that that can be kind of a pain in the butt. So tip, just make sure that any gift cards you want to use are saved in here before the cashier scans this barcode. Okay. Uh, that's just going to save you time, the person in line behind you time, the cashier time. It just saves a lot of time. Um, so that is the gist of Target Circle. Um, they do put their weekly ad in here. So if you want to browse their weekly ad, um, sometimes Target Circle will do exclusive coupons. I know for your birthday, you get an additional like 5% off, I think, for um, a purchase. Sometimes they'll do, you know, 10% off of an item that's always going to show up in here. So you'll always see it. You'll never miss it. Um, but I think that's the gist of Target Circle. So if you have any questions, feel free to uh, leave them below. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. And if you have any video ideas that you want me to do for my next video, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next one.